um, Alana Casey, Lift Big, Eat Big Athlete, and today I'm going to show you how to viper press a log. Um, while doing this, I'm wearing my soft belt, my Titan hard belt, and Titan wrist straps. So I'm going to do it quick for you, the way my normal speed, and then I'll break it down. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Viper press. So, when do you viper press? Viper pressing is good if you're doing a competition that has logs, um, a long log clean and press for reps. Because by viper pressing it, which means we're just going to clean it in one motion straight up, you're going to save energy that you would normally waste sitting at the top, steadying yourself, and then pushing it. So, and you should be able to viper press um, up to about 80% of your max. Of your max. Um, pretty good for at least three reps. So when you start out, you want to get your shins as close as possible to the log. They should actually be flush against the log and touching it. And then I like to angle the log slightly, um, just because when I end up picking it up, it kind of straightens out the handles and makes them parallel with the ground. So on the pick, you want your chest up, head up, and you are not, don't ever curl the log, you are deadlifting it, essentially. So you're pulling it with your lower back. So put up. And then at this point, as much surface contact with the log as possible. And the weight of the log is basically on your knees. And then you want it, the weight to be, before you thrust up, you want it to be sitting on your belt. So the hard belt, I'm not wearing for support. I'm wearing the soft belt for support and the hard belt just to have something to sit the log against. So when I throw my hips forward, I'm literally shooting the log off of my hard belt and off of my knees. So, close as possible. And then at this point, you're gonna shoot your hips forward and just go have your elbows as close to your face as possible, drawing it up your body and straight overhead. And that is gonna take a lot less energy here and then pressing it. I can viper press and it saves time as well. I'll just do a few in a row. Make sure when you're pressing, you're aiming kind of behind your head. A lot of people make the mistake of wanting to push out, and you're never going to get it. So when you go up, aim behind your head. And make sure you start light, so if you lose your balance, you don't take a top. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed my video, and uh, join me next time.